Here's Dean. Sanchez nicks the ball back. Feeds Sunic. He might go for goal. Over the bar. But again, it's Blues making the probes early on here. He's a, a tough one on a bobbly pitch like tonight. It's probably not in the, in the best condition with the games that are on it. As it gets laid across from Sanchez, that little bobbly one, you can see it just drives up. And, so, and Sunjic just can't, because he was trying to do, just bend it into that far corner. He just can't quite get on top of the ball. And the... Deer's ball out wide. And it's gone all the way through here. And it could be a chance for Norwich early on. McLean with the effort and a good save from Neil Etheridge. He was. I thought he was going to come in on the back, of the back post. Bella drills it in this time. Gardner at the back post and a cross goal and Pedersen was just waiting there. Norwich get it away but Blue still have it. Bella again. Wins the corner. Blues are looking so dangerous at the minute and it, these are the times when you've got to score when you're on top. You know, Norwich are living a... Living a... A real, oh, as we see that just go across from Gary Gardner. Somebody's just got to get across the front. Again, the defender really didn't Look as if he knew too much no, about that. He just got himself in a position and it hit him, didn't it? You know, it was, uh, maybe someone getting across the front just to finish that off. But yeah, great spell of pleasure from Blues. Here's the corner. Short to Sanchez. Drill delivery. There's the header. Behind again for another corner. Blues on the front foot here. It's amazing what a result can do. And it looks like a, a set piece that they've worked on. You know, Gary Garner coming in late You know, from the edge of the box. Making it being hard to beat. Doing the nasty and the dirty side of the game. Here's McLean. Slips it through to Puki. He's always dangerous. And there's the opening goal. Totally against the run of play. But it is Norwich City who take the lead here. Timu Puki with his 16th goal of the season. And it's Blues nil, Norwich 1. Well, that, that shows you why Norwich is top of the league. You know... They haven't really come close. We've had one save earlier from Neil Etheridge. You know, good little bit of play in. One ball down the side from a really tight angle, you know, and he's just struck it across Neil Etheridge and in the back of the net. Blues have been in that sort of situation four or five times tonight and uh, and we haven't took it. And Norwich have, you know, and that's why obviously our top goal scorer this morning times on six goals. I think that's 16 for Pukki in it so far this year. You know, sometimes that's that difference when you've got that goal scorer. They can change football matches and that's what's happened after 25 minutes tonight. Clearance from Neil Etheridge there as, as it happens, but Blues have got their composure back and, and back on it straight where they was from uh, before they conceded. Back heel from Bella to Pedersen. His ball away from Hanley. There's the effort from Collar. Hogan trying to follow up as well, but good save in the end from Tim Krull. Excellent strike from Collar though. In a position you probably wouldn't see a fullback, but technique, head over the ball, great strike in. Keeper sees it late, sees it late to be fair, Krull, and gets down and gets some it on it. You know, gets it away from the danger zone, but brilliant strike. Now Gardner. And Sanchez again. And Bella with the effort at the back post and clung on to by Krull. Just behind him, when it good ball in from Sanchez. You know, Norwich make the first contact. Not the greatest defensive header in the world. Just behind him, couldn't quite get the contact that he wanted. Sometimes you see them bounce over the top of the goalkeeper and end up in the far corner of the net. But yeah, just behind him and just couldn't quite get the power and the accuracy on the uh, on the shot from Bella. Here's Vrancic though, slipped in behind and there's another ball through for Timu Puki, but this time Etheridge smothers, but then brings down Campwell. And that will be a penalty to Norwich City. It looked as if he'd got to Timu Puki breaking through, but it was that secondary challenge. He does brilliant the first one, you know, great starting position as he comes out. Just doesn't quite claim the ball and just releases it. Second one, he's just got to leave that. It's, it's a tough one, you know, as a, as a defender or goalkeeper, you want to you make up for the, the little error. But it's a brilliant starting position for him to come out and claim it, but yeah, it's, Campbell's playing for it a little bit, you know, he's felt the touch, gone down very easy. But it's a, it is a penalty. Well, Puki will have a chance to get Norwich's second and his second of the night. Can he make up for his error with a save? Well, two penalty saves for Etheridge this season. Can he make it a third? 
And he does make it a third. Etheridge saves from Puki. Brilliant thing. Sometimes you see it happen, you know, when it's a, it's a dubious penalty, it's not quite there. You know, Neil Etheridge, he makes up for his error of giving the penalty away. It's a poor penalty from Puki. I don't know if he's trying to sit Etheridge down or go down the middle. It's a, it's a poor penalty. Not the most convincing from Krul and Zimmerman and Scott Hogan doing well. Almost finding Gardner. Could be a chance for Sanchez. Oh. Could save from Krul. And yes! there's the follow-up. And Blues are level. Ivan Sanchez. His second goal of the season. And that is so well deserved. Listen, totally deserved. We know where he should have been 1-0 down. But brilliant. It comes from Scott Hogan and his press, you know. And this is one thing we've done superb all night. You know, he's there, he's pressing, wins that ball back. This is a great little dink into the space for Gary Gardner and this little touch out to Sanchez. Brilliant. Hits the target, maybe should do better with the first one, but reacts really well and just slots it home. Excellent. And the Blues deserve to be in this game. You know, they've, they've, been, they've been fantastic for 38 minutes of the game. Don't deserve to concede. And this has got them straight back into it. Blues back level against the league leaders. And Ivan Sanchez, the man that has got them there. Such good work, as you say, Darren, from Scott Hogan. Ivan Sanchez bringing his side deservedly level. And here's Scott Hogan through. And could he put them in front? No. Good chance for Scott Hogan. That just lifts it over the bar. Fancy him. Little half volley. This is a lovely little ball from Gary Garner into the space in behind. You know, just hit the target. You, know, you expect him just to get his head over the ball. You think about Collins' chance earlier when he got his head over the ball, hit the target with it. And I think anywhere other than where he's put it, and it's 2-1 to Blues. You know, the confidence from the weekend, you expect him to put them chances away. Ball through again for Timu Puki. Tried to get round Etheridge, who stuck out a leg well. And then the effort after that, well, well into the stand. He's done that well a couple of times. I've said I know the penalty situation, but Etheridge, he's starting position in behind the back four as he gets played in. Just times his slide really well. It's a really good save, isn't it? Without that leg, Puki was in. He was in, wasn't he? Yeah. I think that's the substitution we spoke about just now. I think Jan Valerie will come on and play as a, as a sort of more of a defensive right winger. Strong run from McLean, and he feeds Hernandez. And heads into the box. And now Buendia unable to pull the trigger. And it does break here for Puki. And it is in. And there's no offside flag against him. And Norwich do take the lead late on here at St Andrews. Just want, just want that little bit of luck sometimes, you know. And Buendia, he's, he's sold a dummy. He hit a left foot shot that's going nowhere. It takes a deflection off someone. I'm trying to think who it is. Here he is on his right foot, just dummies it on his left foot, takes a deflection. Oh, it's so unlucky. Falls to Peter. Oh, just sometimes when things just don't go for you, and Blues don't deserve that. You know, Puki ain't been in the game the whole guy, and, and he scored two goals. You know, sometimes he's, that's the difference in football. You know, Harley Dean, he's, he's, he's unlucky, to be fair. He's, he just gets the block on the ball and it just drops down, and in them situations, Puki's the man. Just that kind of striker, a real poacher. And he's shown that tussling with Connor. Roberts back into the area. Pedersen's effort from range. And that flies wide from Christian Pedersen. Seen him score from that sort of area at Bournemouth, didn't we? You know, just offside. But this time, just he sort of went for a side foot rather than for a, for a laces volley. Tried to place it and, uh, yeah, just off target for Blues, Etheridge, Pyle drives it forward, will it fall for anyone here, here's Collett, gets it across, headed away, San Jose misses the header and now there could be a real chance for Norwich to wrap it up, it's three men on the goalkeeper, it's Lucas Rupp, plays it across and there it is, Ollie Skip, making sure and Norwich have a third goal, and Blues succumb to another defeat. It's, 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 it's not what Blues deserve, you know. It's a mistake by, by San Jose as it comes out. Just misreads the bounce totally. 
You know, and that's what happens when you've not long been on the pitch. And, uh, and Norwich just go and do the simplest of tasks of, the, of putting it in the back of the net. But Blues don't deserve this. You know, they've, 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 this has been probably one of the better performances that we've had this year. You know, but we've just come up against a Norwich side that have been more ruthless than us in the, in the, in the opposition's oppos uh, box. You know, and that's what good teams do. Teams that are looking for getting promotion, that's what they do. They kill teams off when they get their chances. And Blues have had the probably similar amount of chances to Norwich, but... But we need to take heart from the performance because the performance has definitely been there today. Well, there is full time at St Andrews Trillian Trophy Stadium, a clinical Norwich City side.